YouTube. Um, first of all, uh, apologies for the sound quality of my last video. Uh, a couple of videos before when I had the camera pointing too far. To filmmaking is not my forte. Uh, I am not Steven Spielberg, um, so I apologise for that. But I thought I'd basically do my first ever product review video. I'm going to review my my helmet. Um, so I've been running a long time, mainly wearing RI, Shoei, AGV, Nitro, uh, Kiwi, Boeri, um, all fine helmets to be honest with you. Um, but now, I said on a budget, I have to go with my bike budget video. Um, I can't afford an RI unfortunately anymore. Um, so uh, I got a K bag condo, which the reason why I got this handle, by the way, is because it's got a five star sharp rating. So in the UK, you can't get higher than that now. The sharp rating test, I don't know too much about because it's not that old. Um, you know, when I used to buy helmets, it used to basically used to look for a helmet with the ACU gold stamp on the back uh, but apparently that's it still exists but it all goes on the sharp test but um, I basically bought a K-Bay Condor which has got as I've just said five stars um, I got it because it's a flip helmet and basically for my needs um, a flip helmet um, seemed ideal and it is ideal for me to be honest with you um, going about my daily business going to petrol stations just to see how it's off you flip it up and you know they know you know people like in the petrol station know you're not going to pull a gun and, and rob them with your full face helmet um, but yeah back to the helmet yeah I think it's quite a snazzy looking helmet um, I'm really pleased to be honest with you um, it feels quite good quality K bag from uh, Italy, Italia. Um, in my experience, Italy makes some very stylish products. So there you go. Um, you have the normal visor and the sun visor, which, to be honest with you, what I first thought was a gimmick. Uh, I think this is very good, and I use it a lot because, especially in the UK, you can't plan the weather. Um, Sometimes you know you might you might leave for your ride on a dull day. It might turn sunny. So you've got built-in sunglasses. Um, one thing I will say, it's quite close to the nose. Um, it does actually not rub. When I say rub on my nose, it touches my nose. It doesn't upset it, but you know I've got quite a big nose, so most people will be alright anyway. Um, but yeah, that's fine. The visor's fine. The flip is fine. Flipped up great, really handy uh, for talking to people. Um, the fashion itself is something quite new to me. Um, basically, quite a simple idea, really. Basically, lifts up, clicks on, and latches onto the um, thing, but it seems strong. I'm used to the old RID ring or the showy um, seatbelt fastening, but yeah, feels fine. The interior um, feels quite good quality. Um, this thing on the chin, I don't even know what it's called. Um, you can take it in or out, but I leave it in. But I don't know what the difference is to be honest with you, it's in or out. But yeah, seems seems fine to me. Uh, the interior is removable to be washed. Um, so oh yeah, it's Bluetooth compatible. Which I don't know how that works, but there you go. But what's the difference between this and say an Ally? Um, I think. Probably the RI has probably got more more vents, more good quality vents, um, and it, in general it's more controllable vent wise. But I think talking about quality and safety, um, if the sharp test is anything to go by, um, I th I think think this is good enough. You know, it's it's good helmet, it's nice helmet. Um, 
noise wise I, I kept fine with it um, criticisms these little um, fitting you told the visor on sometimes a little bit fiddly um, you take your visor off sometimes they're a bit awkward to get back on but at the moment they're on the fine so but you know this retails at 119 pounds in the UK and I would personally think that that's quite a lot of help for your money um, and I'm, I'm quite pleased you know um, don't get me wrong if, if I had a lot of money I would probably go and buy another RI because I do love RI but I don't have the luxury right now but if you don't have that luxury of buying an RI um, you can't go far wrong with, with, with a K-Bag you know uh, it's tr strongly recommend, recommended um, hey, thank you very much for watching and hopefully the audio is okay on this one. Take care, thank you.